Sure, bubble wrap is a great way to keep items safe when you ship them, and it's fun to pop it when your package arrives, but now it has an even higher calling. Eddie D. Jamal looks at bubble wrap art. Bubble wrap. It's fun to pop and is a lifesaver when it comes to packing. But just wait until you see what this artist is doing with it. My name is Bradley Hart. I'm a New York based visual artist originally from Toronto, Canada, and I'm known for making visual art using bubble wrap. That's right. Bradley uses his canvas and turns it into pixelated works of art. And one of the inspirations for his work came from Bubble Wrap's original intended purpose. Bubble Wrap was never intended to be packaging material. Everybody loved the idea of popping it and imagining they could wrap their glasses in it and anything that's fragile that they need to protect. But the reality is the Bubble Wrap was invented in 1957 by two engineers in New Jersey as a modern version of wall cover. That's right, it was wallpaper. It never made it to market. It failed as an experiment. Obviously it made an impact in the packing industry, but Bradley decided to play with the idea of bubble wrap as a wall covering, so he took a roll and got to work. And the process is just as painstaking as you might expect. Once he selects an image to paint, I then go about the process of loading the thousands of syringes it's going to take in the up to 116 different colors that I use. Then, using a computer software Bradley created, he carefully creates a map of color placement and then individually injects each bubble with acrylic paint. And as far as how long it takes? That really depends. A painting like the one that's over my shoulder could take me anywhere from two to three weeks. And when the painting is complete, there's a giant sheet of paint that is all congealed together from all the different drips. Resulting in a second painting, an impression of the original piece. It's like, wow! And you have that aha moment. And in the over 10 years he's been injecting, he's created over 100 paintings, some of which you can visit during his art exhibitions. While my works live in collections around the world in private collectors' homes, Bradley hopes his art will inspire people to get off their phones and experience art in the real world. Go to museums, go to galleries, feel in the energy of the work that these great artists are creating for you. In my case, the gentle pixelization and the three-dimensional sculptural nature of my work, which disappears online. For more information and for dates of future exhibitions, you can head to bradleyhart.ca. Bursting through the norm with bubble wrap art.